First things first. The descaling pod contains citric salt for scale removal. When descaling your water bar, it can't be used for approximately six hours. It's therefore best performed overnight. And remember, your water bar needs to be descaled before you change your filter. Right, let's get started. Remove the lid from your T7 water bar. Press push and pull the filter up using the ribbon tab. Dispose of the filter in accordance with your local authority guidelines. If your filter is stuck, you can release the pressure by turning off the blue tap behind the machine and pressing to dispense cold water. The pressure will be released and the filter should come out easily. Take the descaler pod and wet the stems of the pod with water to lubricate before inserting. Insert the pod into the filter's position, either way around, until it clicks firmly into place. Do not drink water from the water bar from this point until the process is complete. Press the extra hot button and wait for the water to boil. Place a 5 litre container under the spout. We find a big red plastic bucket does the trick. Press the hot button and let the hot water run for one minute. Now stick that important warning label on the front of the device to ensure no one uses it and wait for six hours whilst the descaling magic happens. Okay, so that wasn't six hours, but this is a how-to video and we can't actually wait for six hours. Next, press the extra hot button and then wait until the water boils. Dispense four liters of water by pressing the hot button. Air may still be present in the system, so a light spluttering may occur. To remove the descaling pod, press push, remove the pod, and dispose of it in accordance with your local authority guidelines. The descaling process is now complete. Unwrap your new filter, making sure the ribbon tab stays in place. Insert the filter until you hear a click. It's now safe to remove your warning label. Nobody likes hot air, so let's get rid of it. Place a container under the spout and press the cold button for two minutes. Now wait for 10 minutes. Once 10 minutes is up, place a jug under the cold button and dispense for two minutes. If your jug fills up, just stop, empty it, and then keep going. Now follow the on-screen instructions. Now you're all done, you can replace the lid. 